Hello everybody, Slim Kirby here. Welcome back to more of the legendary Starfy playthrough. Uh, last time we finished up the Hotcha Springs levels, and now we're moving on to world number three, the Chili Dip Cove. So it looks like we're going to have a bit of a snow slash ice world on our hands, so that sounds cool to me. Let's go ahead and get started. Okay, looks like another level where we could actually use Starfy, again, if we have the uh, local multiplayer capabilities, but since we don't, we're going to go ahead and just uh, get right on here and start this level. Only one chest to find, so shouldn't be too hard, at least I would expect that to be the case anyway. Okay, let's see what Mo wants to say. Well, we've come a long way, but it's freezing cold. My shell's chattering. If Starly was here, we could wrap this up and get out of here fast. What do you think? I don't need help. No? Alright, Starf, but you gotta hurry before my shell freezes shut. <laughs> You'll be fine, Mo. You'll be fine. Okay, so yeah, let's go ahead and start uh, Chili Dip Cove. So it looks like we have a lot of ice. We can break the ice using our fabled star spin. So that'll be nice. Looks like we also have icicles that we have to look out for. And they actually like shatter too, so be very, very careful. Oh god, that was close. I hate that these like water currents are trying to like Hold us back there. Oh, we even got penguins. Penguins? Aw, oh, they're building snow penguins. That's cute. <laughs> that is actually pretty cute that that's a thing right there. Uh, so yeah, right here, uh, this looks like something that we can't do. That's probably something for Starly to do. Since she has that wall jump technique. Indeed, that's exactly what that is, so we're just going to not really worry about that. Instead, we're going to ride this ice block down the slope. Now, for those of you wondering, like, you know, with all those starly sections that we've been finding in this game... Wondering, well, why the hell do they have sections like that that require uh, multiplayer to do? Well, there is actually something else uh, to mention about those sections, but uh, I believe that's something we'll get later in the game. So I'm not going to really uh, talk about that at the moment, but uh, there, there, is, there are other reasons for sections like that to exist. And I don't know, maybe the way I'm kind of pointing that out, maybe that kind of gives it away. If it does, I apologize, but... Again, um, it's not a flaw of the game or anything. Besides, it's not like you can't play levels again, so you can always get, like, more pearls if, uh, you're trying to grind for some of the expensive items in this game. Okay, so here we have Globerto's Note. Let's see... Try tapping Starfy and Mo on the title screen for a surprise. Also, the more stages you clear, the more guests you'll show up on the Mo Show. You know about the Mo Show, right? I do know about the Mo Show. We, we, we've taken a look at the Mo Show from time to time. I'll try to actually showcase that more, because it is actually kind of a funny thing, or a, just a... Not really just a funny thing, but even just like... It's cool when you see, like, characters in, a, in an adventure game like this interact. I always really like that dynamic, because it just kind of shows that, you know, uh, a lot more thought went into this universe and all the characters that are in it, so... It's kind of cool that that's like, actually a thing, you know? Okay... Brr, I know I complained about the heat, but this cold is worse, I tell ya. Hey, Bunston, you don't even look chilly. What gives? My spacesuit keeps me quite warm. If it ever gets too hot, I can just... Thwomp! What is that? 
Sounds like an avalanche, Starfy. Look out. Avalanche? Oh, God. That's not an avalanche. That's a snowball. Snowball controls jump. <laughs> That's it. You just jump. <laughs> The fact that, like, they made it out like it was going to be more than that is just kind of funny. Well, we haven't had to jump so far. Wow. <laughs> Watch that be, like, the last thing, like, in this section. <laughs> It's like, oh, that was the only thing you had to jump over. No, there's another one. Okay. <laughs> do, 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 do. Sorry, I got nothing to say, but, like, I don't. <laughs> you okay, Starf? Whoa, you do look a little dizzy. How many Moes do you see? I can't believe Starfy is alright. Wow, what a ride. Who are those penguins? I don't know, but they sure weren't friendly. Let's keep looking around. Okay, so there we go. Let's go ahead and say hello to our mermaid gal. Let's actually check in with her, by the way. You stopped alright. Are you still dizzy? Uh, hello, I'm over here. I need to actually look at that stuff more because, you know, lots, lots of flavor text. Flavor text is a good thing, after all. You can actually sink in the snow, but I don't think there's a reason to do that. Yeah, there might be. Oh, yeah, there are reasons to sink down here. The thing is, I don't know if, like... If you can sink to the very bottom, if, like, you'll die or anything. I think it's just literally the bottom of that section. Okay, well, that's it for that level. That level was pretty quick. Not a lot to see right here. Let's go ahead and move on. I wonder if we're actually going to get any more than just, like, four levels per world. I actually do not remember. But okay, we have uh, stage 3-2. The spin is mightier. The spin is mightier than the sword. Who needs a sword when you can spin, honestly? We're on a serious mission. Out of the way, Pipsqueak. It's Pipleon, not Pipsqueak. Hey, Starfy. That must be your yappy clam friend, Mo, huh? The squirts told me you're looking for a shard. My brother found one of those yesterday. What are we waiting for? Let's talk to your brother. Where is he? Um, yeah. Can you help us? I'm sorry for calling you Pipsqueak. Hey, thanks, Mo. Sorry I called you yappy. Do you really want to meet my brother? I hope you guys are good swimmers. As long as Starf uses his mighty star spin, we'll be fine. I think... What is it, Starf? Are you kidding me? You forgot how? But it's your famous move. I'll put it on the ability screen. Wait, haven't I been using that? Or unless there's, like, a bigger variation of it. No matter how many adventures we go on, he never remembers how to do his move. Sheesh. We were attacked in Chili Dip Cove by a bunch of penguins. They rolled Starfy into a snowball. Oh, you're talking about King Ping's minions. They're usually pretty chilled out, but sometimes they can be pretty icy to strangers. First Hot Spring Snapper, now King Ping? A lot of strange folks around these parts. Come on, let's go find Pip Leon's brother already. I need a break from all these weirdos. So the Mighty Star Spin. Use this move just under the surface to pop out and leap into the sky. 
Okay, so for that, you have to use, like, the arrow and the spin at the same time. And you can also leap out of the water, too, which is pretty cool. Okay. So, ugh. 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 Yeah, that's how you do the st mighty star spin. It's really no different than the normal star spin, if I'm being honest, but... Okay. You do what you gotta do to survive in the world of Starfy. Okay, I see a lot of uh, walls we can interact with here. Before I go up there, though, let's keep moving. Is that really all this is? I guess. Okay, well, never mind then. Um, do I want to go that way? Oh, shoot, sorry. I love how I said sorry to enemies that were clearly attacking me. Okay, well, let's do this then. Since the arrows are pointing that way, let's see what's in here first. Here we got the splattered clothes. So we got some more costume icon or costumes to wear. What the? Hi. Okay. Is there a reason to do that? I guess not. Hold on, I'm gonna check something. Because I did notice that the, uh... We can do this again? Oh, okay. So you can harvest that a couple of times, but after a while you have to stop. Okay, well we got some pearls out of that, so I'm not going to complain. Let's continue on with our adventure, shall we? We... Okay, now we can go this way. Oh, you can actually use the Mighty Star Spin to get through some of these uh, wind currents a little faster. Or, like, not the slower ones you can, but not the really fast ones. So we have to be careful of those. That's interesting. good for this room. I just want to verify. Do, 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 do. Okay, we're good. Hi, Globerto. Oh, wow, you can actually go really high with this. There's got to be something up here. Ooh. Okay, good. I'm still getting that. I wonder if you could, like, ride it backwards to, like, get the penguins again. That could actually be, like, a really good grind.
Ah, uh, well, I pushed against that. Oh, well. And then jump out of here. Okay. Let's go ahead and save our game, and then go in here now. Okay, we got more of this. Oh, no, no, okay, I didn't lose it. <laughs> I just barely had it off screen, so it was still technically on screen, I guess. Okay. Mighty leap Starfy can make. Gotta give the little guy props. He can sure jump. Starfy, I've been looking all over for you. You have to help. The Gelato sisters are trapped in the current. Save them, Starfy. There they are. Do you see them? Up there in the swirling water? The Gelato sisters are stuck in fast currents. Save them. I suppose, if I must, of course we'll save them. We gotta, we gotta save them. We gotta save. I mean, everyone likes gelato, right? I know that's different than actual gelato, like <laughs> the sweet treat gelato, but still. go all the way through here. Oh, I see him. Or see her, since it's... I think they said Gelato Sisters, so... I want that big pearl first. There we go. Let's go down here. Wait, are there more? Oh, I guess there's more. Phew, thanks, phew. We didn't think we'd ever get out of those bubbles. Piplion, what are you doing here? I saw you get swept away in the current, so I followed you. Luckily for us, Starfy was here, too. We can't thank you enough for Starfy. That was so brave of you. What can we do for you? Oh, I know. We'll break this ice that's blocking the door. That sounds like a good idea to me. Damn. There was some hard hitting to make that open like that. Okay, do I wanna... I think I got everything of major note here. Oh, there's something there. I don't wanna necessarily go through all of this though, if it's just gonna be for like pearls, so. Go ahead and just leave. Still gotta find the secret exit, and then also there's another chest we have to find, too. So let's go ahead and look for that. I noticed that, uh... I'm trying not to go too far in case... It's, like, hidden in, like, a uh, little section like that. There we go. Yep. We got it. What do we got here? Got another mini game. Starfy, you got here at just the right time. I need your help. Oh, come on. Don't worry. I'll give you a good reward. King Ping's minions keep making these creepy snowmen. They give me the chills. Those snowmen keep staring at me. I don't trust them not a bit. Smash them up for me. 
What do you say? Sure. That's the spirit. Now get out there and smash some snowmen. Jeez. Doesn't like snowmen. Oh, that's right. Okay, so they, we have to do this fast. Not only do we have to do this fast, we have to, like, keep smashing them fast so we always have, like, a leg up on the others. How, like after the time ended one got added back to their score nice thanks to you those punks are packing it up and going home oh the reward I uh, didn't forget let me see here I know I'll tell you about this amazing secret place that only I know about okay so that's the first secret area of this world we'll check that out later and I think that's I think I said level five so um, sorry, not now. But yeah, I said level 5, so once again, we have another 4 level world of just, like, the main stuff anyway. Okay, gonna ride this out to this side. Guessing the chest is gonna be in this room. Yep, okay. Whoa. Um, I hope I didn't go too far. I may have actually messed this up. Oh, no, there it is. At least I think we're still in the running for it. Ugh, I don't like the look of that passageway up there. Oh, my, no, there we go. You probably just missed out on a bunch of pearls, then. Uh, so here we have Piplian's Diary. Let's go ahead and read that. I met Starfy today. That was so exciting. I've heard so much about him. His friends are super cool, too. I can't wait to introduce them to my brother. Hopefully I can get him away from his snacks for, like, five seconds. Jeez. Snack-shaming the big brother, huh? That's how it's gonna be? Okay, well, there we go. There's the... Yeah, so if you went that long way, you'd get, like, a whole bunch of pearls. This could actually be a really good level for pearl farming. Because you have those, like, automatic ice sections, and then you also have this. I'm gonna see if I can do this. I don't think I can, but... No, doesn't look like it. Okay, well, that's okay. Something to keep in mind for later if we are, if I do decide to do the 100% uh, grinding. Well, there we go. We've cleared uh, pretty much half of. Uh... Actually, you know what? Let me do this, actually. Just to show this off really quick. Like I mentioned, if you uh, go here, you can actually take a shortcut to the minigame. What's cool about this is you actually continue the level from where you were before. So if you do that and go back here, we're back in this section. Go through here, and wasn't this the... It was. Okay, so if you just go up here... That's about like a hundred uh, pearls right there. So yeah, a nice little quick grinding spot if you really want to take advantage of that. 
Uh, but I'm going to go ahead and end this video here. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time for more of the Legendary Starfy, where we'll uh, basically take on uh, the next level and maybe even the boss level too, if I don't get like distracted and <laughs> can't finish it in time. Uh, but yeah, I'll uh, see you guys later. Later, folks.